There's just a little more than two weeks until Chicago selects its next mayor. Now, candidates Paul Vallis and Brandon Johnson are spending their weekend meeting neighbors and debating each other again. CBS 2's Marissa Perlman followed the candidates on their campaign trails today. Let me see how these folks are. Hey, how y'all doing? Hey, Brandon. With two weeks to go, Commissioner Brandon Johnson makes the rounds, meeting and greeting with local vendors in Little Village. <laughs> and now, in the 11th hour of campaigning, it's all about endorsements. Johnson toured the market with 25th Ward Alderman Byron Sigcho Lopez. Brandon! This year's summit. At the Woodlawn Community Summit, both candidates were shaking hands with business owners and community leaders. I look forward to the remaining two weeks. It's kind of like a marathon race. Each had two minutes to speak, talking policing, housing, and economic development. I've always viewed the most effective way of growing communities. Uh, the most effective way is really deferring to the communities and empowering the communities to take control of their own destiny. The best thing you can do for a neighborhood is to make sure we are organizing a neighborhood. Right, that's, that's who I am through and through as an organizer. Can you name one specific issue? And at a mayoral forum on the South Side, candidates went head to head. Both were asked whether this mayoral contest is really between the Chicago Teachers Union, which supports Johnson, and the Fraternal Order of Police, which supports Vallis. This is a battle between the politics of old that have left black communities in particular behind versus a better, stronger pathway forward. The best thing that we can do in this moment is to have real deliverables for black families. This is a battle to make sure that every single community in this city uh, is a community that is safe and secure. This is a battle that ensures that all schools are community schools, where the resources, the, the $30,000 per child that is spent on public education actually finds its way into those neighborhood schools. Paul Vallis also campaigned in Pullman Saturday afternoon. The runoff election is two weeks from Tuesday. Reporting in the control room, I'm Marissa Perlman, CBS 2 News. Early voting begins Monday. That evening, candidates Paul Vallis and Brandon Johnson will meet head to head in a debate at the Chicago History Museum. Our CBS 2 investigator Dorothy Tucker will be one of the panelists asking questions. And you can watch the debate live on our website, CBS 2 Chicago. It all starts at 530 Monday afternoon.